What up, party people? Just finished, actually, I just finished the front nine video here. Bringing it into the back nine. So, even on the front nine, we're gonna try to lock it in on this back nine and bring in a negative score. I don't know. Just try to shoot good, really. Wind lift, but I should be fine. That's a putt. You can never complain about a putt. That's the rules in disc golf. Never complain about a putt. My tournament schedule just finished Tallahassee. Did a recap in the last video. Now, in two weeks, we have my second AC of the year. My second chance to. Oh, that's the end of the song. You should only get one shot. So I guess I'm lucky. I get two chances. Get to play against more touring pros and really kind of test my skill and see where I'm at as a disc golfer. I know I'm 960 rated, but I feel like I'm better. But then again, 960 like is like your average. So I mean, maybe I am 960. I don't know. But the win played with this one a little bit, had a little fun. Like I said before, you can never complain about a putt. So, try to give this one like a little spinny little run. Start off the back now, right? That's why you can never complain about a putt. Because if you're good, I mean, really, if you think about it, you got like 50 50 shot of making every putt. You either make it or you don't. 50 50. You make it, yeah. You make it, you don't, yeah. That is a good putt on the last hole. And I'm not sure if you. I was wondering why I'm feeling so like <clears throat> today. I realized, first off guys, this is the other thing, I don't do caffeine, I don't drink coffee, any drinks, none of that. But today, woke up early, because my dog just had surgery, so I need to be back before my wife leaves. She's going on a brunch with her friend. I was like, I need to go play, get around in early, film two videos, post them. I woke up this morning, I was like, ah, super tired. So I was like, ah, oh, let me go get one of these any drinks, Celsius, shout out, Celsius. They were good. So that's why I got so much energy. Just get out there, make the, make the upshot across, make the putt, move on with your life. You can't, I mean, why would you not bag a rock? Shout out my boy, shout out my boy Casey White. That boy makes, boy makes a good disc. Shout out Casey, the Casey White rock. It's a good one. So got kind of like a left to right push in here. So I really want to go forehand, and I probably could, it would push it over. But I kind of want to go backhand to kind of take away, go away from that wind, and push it down. And kind of just get across and maybe throw it a little bit to the right of the basket. I'll usually go with the putter here, just because the wind, like I said, I'm going to beef up to a zone. Oh, that's so bad. Get left, please. That's so long, too. It's a putt. It might be bad, but it's a putt. Down here in the trenches. But, water right behind it, but low-key, kind of same shot as last hole, or same putt as last hole. A little, little, in the trenches, a little uphill. Maybe I'm just like born in the trenches. You know, make it out of the slums. Slum anthem. Spin this one at right the basket. Don't go up That's the goal here. last second these you guys you know coming up two weeks like i already said and this is the main course that the tournament's gonna be played on it's a john house on course probably no not probably definitely our best course in the area this course is definitely my favorite it's super fun probably my top three courses i've ever played along with another john house design course that's gonna be called wr jackson which is i am slowly getting more and more depressed that it's getting taken out but here it is you know, you live and you learn. They'll make another good course. So, been getting a bunch of practice on this course. I really, really, really want to perform well in the city mobile. And the only way I'm going to do it is by practicing this course and putting pressure on myself and executing every shot. So, hole 12, part three. Part three! Oh, let's see. You just want to hit the gap. It's like a little uh, hole. hole. It's sitting up on a mound. 
Hit the gap. You got a putt. You good. Get left. That's good. All right, that's right here. Good drive. Part one, executed. Part two, make the putt. Wind is red. And I mean, the chains are literally just sideways. I mean, hello? I mean, I just like spin it more. Yeah, that's how you got like a 40 foot come back because the wind just like carries it and then you take a bogey. So, just lock in. Bro, I know y'all can't hear it because I got this. There was a... There was a thing with Mike. A wind cover? Uh-oh. That audio is going to be ruined. So y'all can't hear how windy it is. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry, guys. That's just, that's on me. I might have to box some more of these covers now. After that, awful looked into a birdie on last hole. Hole 13, another par 3. Get right, dude. It did. It's gonna be a circle too, but alright. Audio's probably not good here. We got some train coming by. They knew I was filming today, so they said, okay. Audio's already bad, let's make it worse. Inside C1. Okay. Can't get the old push. So what is the city of mobile match city of mobile mobile however you want to say it city of mobile championships is what i like to call the matt orm invitational um these are all his hometown courses so anybody that feels free to get absolutely destroyed by matt orm come on down uh you won't be the first uh we've at mobile have been taking it for years so welcome and he will for sure 90 percent beat everybody on, on the field by at least five strokes not kidding do literally tear these courses apart. Got that. Good kick. I think I'm gonna go like super flex through this gap. Try to get myself a putt. <sighs> That's not flex enough. Gotta put that on more angle. All jokes aside, it's a great tournament, but we have a lot of great touring pros coming this year. So it'll be a good tournament on my home courses too. It'll be a good tournament for me to see how I stack up for these uh, against these guys. So let's go ahead and uh, try to save this bar and we can talk about that next hole too. Save the par. But the reason I feel like City Mobile is also so big this year is because it's got that elusive uh, USCGC qualifying spot, which I'll talk about next hole. I think I'm single spoiled already. That's obviously the goal. I lied. I'm talking about right now. That's obviously the goal, but that's like up here. Like if I play the greatest disc golf I've ever played in my life. Um, the main goal, just cash. Top 20, top 15, if I play great, I think I can do it. I'd have to put together three great rounds 
And the way I've been feeling like my back has been playing and the way I've been practicing both courses, I honestly feel like it's possible. Um, let's go ahead. This is this sole is my nemesis hole. I have at least one of these on every single course. Um, still trying to figure it out. I'm gonna try to go the flex forehand. Usually I try to go that backhand to that right gap, but I'm gonna try the flex forehand with a fire bird. That's just way too low. That's so bad. Now what will I throw here? Maybe the rock again? I threw it good last time. My scramble shot. Okay, this may be a little harder than I thought. Hey, that's right in the middle. You can't complain about that. This hole is just classic John Hout design. He loves those two gaps. So this hole he goes two gaps, land spot, two gaps. Kind of like the right side on this one. Proxy. Get a nice little height on it. <laughs> kind of like that. Hey, give yourself a round of applause there. So, like I was saying on last hole, the goal for this tournament, really, what I really want to do is I would love to come in top 15. Now, is it going to take some pretty dang good disc golf? Yeah, but. I have belief in myself, and I feel like I can really do it. Um, a lot of touring players here, like I've said, but I have the advantage. I feel like I've gotten way more practice in these courses. I know the holes, the holes you need to get, the holes you need to uh, pull back from. I know where the danger is. I mean, they will too, but they won't have as much knowledge as me. Also, quick question: Does anybody else find it kind of hard to play in a hoodie? I feel like it kind of like just grabs me in the inappropriate places, you know. You didn't see the front on because I shot a different video, but it's whatever. That's all you need to, do. You need to know is I'm shooting neg three and I'm not playing the best today. So that's a win for me, honestly. That's going to be a little left, I think, but that's, that's a good shot. Good shot. Can't ever complain about a putt, especially when that putt's like, I don't know. 15 feet. Look like classic uh, two-way hole, I guess you can call it. I'm gonna try this right gap with my money destroyer. Shout out Landon McDonald, he gave me this at my bachelor trip. I love it, it's great. And that's good. Get around it, you got through it. Hit that last tree, that's fine though. Uh oh. That disc is not as stable as I thought it was. First time throwing it, guys. Give me, give me some slack, please. Thank you. Okay. This is real bad. Thought that this was more overstable. Um, it's not. Now I'm stuck with this right here. And I'm not sure if you can see um, this big wall of trees. You may, may not be able to see the wall of trees in front of me. Um, but yeah, there's no way to get out of this. So. I'm gonna go with the old forehand roller that way, spin it back, take my bogey, get out of here. You can't see that, but I think it's good. Not the worst, not the best. It's fine. I'm, I'm, I'm you know, I'm playing decent enough today. I'm okay with taking a, a bogey. It's fine. Put this one up in the air, stand still. Working on this. Definitely not my best shot in my arsenal. But we're working on it, so. Let's work on it here. <sighs> Proxy again. That's why it's not my best shot in my arsenal, because I come on over. Okay. Man, I really got to do some work on those stand still back in. Sometimes they, sometimes they just come out, they feel like they're so good, and other times, I don't know. I don't know, folks. Just grow a little wet. But, they're not wet enough. Just like a little stepper. I got that more height, that's probably in. Full 18, like I said, tough par five.
just a worst case scenario. I'm not gonna lie. Kind of rushed right there. There was a dude coming up on the next T-Pad. I was like, okay, camera's in his way. No excuses. No, never mind. I didn't rush. This is just a bad shot. Oh, that's gonna be bad too. So I'm in there. This is the actual fairway. Uh, let's just be honest. Uh, when you're not to the red pads or no, wait a minute, when you're not to the white pads on a par five, you can might as well just chalk it up. So I threw that that far, threw it that hard, and it got that far. Ow! All right, force. Just pop it down there, Ooh, skip back. It should be this disc is wet. That's really all I wanted to do. All right. The other shot, skip around the corner, get up and down, take the double, live with it, you're fine. Could have finished like worse. On this shot, the corner looks like it's a lot closer than it is. So you like to play it out and just let it kind of skip. Kind of like that. I'd rather be deep than short. And that's right up against a tree. All right, branch this shot. I'm gonna try to throw like a little Flex for here, just to get up and down. That's what I want to do. You can't see that, but that's probably 160 foot short. All right, I was gonna wait to do the outro after this, but camera's leading on two percent. Um, so just want to thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you have any suggestions down in the comments. Like I said, I really want to talk about sitting my bill this round or this nine but kind of babbled so to recap want to come in top 15 play that'd be pretty sick it's a uacdc qualifier a lot of pro, pro tour players are going to get there i'll be able to stack myself up against them and see how i played i'm gonna pick up this disc while i talk stay up against them see how i played and I really just want to cash this is maddie invitational if anybody knows that um He'll most likely win because he's just a beast in these courses. He grew up on them, so it is what it is. But I want to play good. I want to prove to myself that you know I am a good disc golfer. And the first thing I, first way I do that is by making this putt. <sighs> you was nervous. The crowd's behind 18. They're going crazy. Oliver, Oliver. You step up. Shh. Quiet the crowd. Doom doom. You feel your heart beating. Tiger Woods. You make your legacy here. Your opponent's part for par. You need this stroke. Calm the mind. Stop! Stop! The crowd!